The Further Teachings of Lao Tzu, 116. Lao Tzu said, Pure emptiness is the clarity of the sky. Non-contrivance is the norm for government. Get rid of favor. Abandon wisdom. Exclude ability. Reject human duty. Eliminate rationalization. Throw away sophistry. And prohibit artifice. Then the intelligent and the uncouth are equal on the way. Be calm and you are equanimous. Be empty and you will get through. Perfect virtue is uncontrived, accommodating all things. The path of emptiness and calm is eternal as heaven and earth. Its spiritual subtlety fills everywhere yet does not control things. The twelve months go through their cycle and then begin again. The powers of the elements overcome each other, but their courses depend on each other. Therefore, extreme cold injures beings, but there cannot be no cold. Extreme heat injures beings, but there cannot be no heat. Therefore, the acceptable and the unacceptable are both acceptable. For this reason, there is nothing that is unacceptable to the great way. Acceptability is a matter of logic. If you do not pursue what is acceptable when you see it, and do not flee what is unacceptable when you see it, acceptability and unacceptability are to each other as left to right, as outside to inside. What is essential in all events must begin from one. Time is their order. Never having changed from ancient times to the present, this is called natural principle. Hold to the great light above. Use his illumination below. The way produces myriad things. Governs yin and yang, transforms them into the four seasons, and divides them into the five elements, each finding its place, coming and going along with time. Laws have constants. When it reaches the powerless below, the way of those above does not overturn, and all citizens are of one mind. The way of heaven and earth is fulfilled without contrivance, attained without seeking. This is how we know that it is free from artificiality and is beneficial.